Hello there guys, this is TCG Maniac from YouTube and The Real Deal from Discord. Uh, today I'll be going through how to go, how to use untap.in and a step-by-step -step guide on building your deck and in putting in decks for uh, the Chaos Chronicles. So the first thing you gotta do is you need to use a computer because uh, Untap only runs on a computer. Uh, that's the only device it can run on. So get a computer and install some sort of uh, browser and uh, put in untap.in in your search bar and you will come to this page. So in this page uh, you'll see your username, uh, password and now you will have to click on register. So once you register, uh, it will bring up the page for username, uh, register password, and just type those in and you're good to go. Once you have done that, log in and you should see this page. They may ask you to choose three categories, just choose three random ones, but the custom CCG is the most important to pick out. Uh, because that's where you will play Chaos Galaxy. Now once you come in, you'll see your, the chat and everything, uh, but the first thing you want to go to is decks. Uh, in your deck, you will see this page. Uh, it should be empty, uh, but I have a lot of decks for Chaos Galaxy, other games and stuff, uh, but yeah. So the first thing you want to do is click on create deck. Uh, select custom CCG and uh, type in a deck title. So I want to make an infinite deck, so I'll make that. Create deck. And now uh, you will come to this page where there's absolutely nothing other than a few words here and no cards at all. So I'll, I'll build a barrow deck, so for, let's put in barrow. Now the thing about this, uh, about untap.in, is that every single card that everyone uploads is all over here. So you can't just find, this is not just, just only for uh, Chaos Galaxy. So I'm gonna put in a barrow and I'll put it in starts in play so when you upload a deck uh, it will start in play so once you've done that uh, you'll see that it puts in 4 so reduce that to 1 since this is the planet card but there is a way to get through uh, past this uh, go to advanced deck options uh, select the default card quantity and click on 2 and you go back to your deck. The next time I put in Barrow again, it will only put in two cards. So let's remove that. And now we want to search for cards that we want to put in in the deck. So since this is an infinite deck, we gotta find infinite, and we can put in infinite in the main deck. And there you go. So. You can add more cards, so let's say I want to add a deck. But the problem is with uh, two cards, which is deck and uh, KO, uh, these two cards are very, very generic. So because it's just a DE, uh, you gotta, you'll you see, if you scroll through here, you'll never find deck. However, you can put parentheses OOC and the uh, parentheses there and it'll come up with all OOC cards in alphabetical order so this is basically set 1 so you'll see de and KO the only time you'll use this though is only to find KO and de but there is another way if you don't wish to scroll which is to search de then just type in chaos galaxy and it'll pop up de uh, same thing for KO. 
and there you go so I could add these cards into the deck and uh, that's it so keep putting in cards uh, remember that the ban list for example if I want to add galaxy crash So if I want to add Galaxy Crush, uh, I gotta reduce that to 1, because it's in the ban list, so just take note of that. Uh, another thing is to upload decks. So let's say, uh, let's remove all of this first. Let's say maybe one of us on Discord posts a deck list, for example the uh, set 1 Chaos Galaxy deck list. So if I go here, uh, you will have to look for. You'll have to first uh, download the deck. I'll send. I'll probably send it in a PDF file or something. But uh, you gotta. So I'm gonna open that file, and you gotta copy all of this. So I'm just gonna Control A, and select everything. Control C, uh, to copy everything, and now go uh, to paste deck from text uh, it will search up main deck and everything uh, but click here and paste your deck so control V once I add everything all the cards will be here and you can import the cards and everything will be imported inside the main deck since I selected it uh, I will move Roka into the expel deck well it's basically a section and once you have done that you basically got the entire set one of chaos galaxy and that's basically it uh, don't forget there will be this warning sign so in case it can't uh, basically check if that if that card uh, somehow maybe s something like this basically so if I click on this you'll see the one origin of chaos pack and one uh, manflaki so let's say I want to put in manflaki you'll see that it types in four manflaki so just simply remove the four and search for manflaki manually and put it in the deck uh, the 4 is basically the amount, so I'll put in 4 man flackies. Once you've done that, you can search for the rest, Origin of Chaos, and put that in starts and play. And reduce that to 1. Once you've done that, save your deck. Now, this is the most important step. If you don't save your deck and just click on exit, it won't save, so I'll save my deck and exit and once you've done that you basically got the set one draft now there are two infinites here so I just gotta delete this one so uh, now you can go into games create a new game and I'm gonna I'm gonna just gonna call it chaos chronicles I'm gonna put it as solo and but of course you can uh, play two players which is to battle but I'm gonna click solo disable the mirror and start so usually when you start two player games it will uh, take about a few a few seconds so uh, before you battle someone just prepare a server first so I'm gonna enter the game and now this is well the game and I'm gonna insert deck so let's insert the infinite deck which is basically set one draft and here you go so you'll see the deck which is this one the uh, second deck which we don't use the discard pile uh, your face down pile and expel pile uh, this if you put your planet in starts and play this would basically be your planet but because this is a uh, origin of chaos pack uh, you'll see this so that's about it uh, 
now let's go through a little bit on uh, the Chaos Chronicles. So for the Chaos Chronicles, I've made it such that you can just play 18 cards. So if you just select that here, put in 18, um, ensure that you select the play and press OK. It'll play 18 cards. Uh, but let's. But that's about it for the ca uh, Chaos Chronicles stuff. Uh, just put. That's basically all you need to know. Now let's say you are in a battle. Now let's just put this back. Actually. Uh, actually no. Let's insert another deck. Uh, let's insert. Uh, Barrow Aggro. Okay. So this is my uh, Chaos Galaxy deck. This is my planet that which I put in starting play, my zones, and my deck, which has 38 cards. Once you've done that, I'm going to draw multiple, and I draw three as a starting hand. So that's how you draw cards. You can also double click to draw one card. You can play cards just like that. You can put cards into the deck, but once you put it in, it will always put on top. So, uh, you should shuffle your deck, which is shuffle, right here. You can play cards from your deck, so let's say there's an ability that says you have to reveal the top card of your deck. Just draw one card into play, and it will just drop the first card, which is Star Absorber. So, uh, that's about it. Uh, as for points, this is your... we use the white space as points, so uh, you can reduce it to zero or you can count down so let's say I gain three points so count down by three uh, this is the black area is your stars so let's say I gain four stars at the start of the turn so four stars uh, left click to gain up right click to go down and that's basically about it if you have any other questions do let me know in the galaxy hashtag the galaxy chat and yeah that's all and if and i'll see you guys next time